just wanted you to know that I've listened to you, and I haven't spent any money today. Good boy. Yeah, I sure hope Kelly hasn't. <gasps> oh, my God! Kel, well, what's in the bag? I bought some new jeans. Dad, you told me to buy new jeans. You said that you hated the way that these look. Oh, all right. Tough luck, maggot. <laughs> Yeah, what can I do for you? Steve, come on in, sit down. What are you doing? Everybody's doing this. And yes, if everyone was jumping off a building, so would I. <laughs> Kel, collect call for you from Australia. <laughs> Excuse me, there must be some sort of a misunderstanding. <laughs> I thought we had code words for things like this. We're late on our code payments. Hey, in a couple of years, they'll be gone. So, Steve, how's the addition? Well, uh, we just talked about it last night. We haven't had much time to actually do anything about it. Yeah, good, good. Uh, yeah, I was thinking that, uh, you know, while the girls are at the gym, this would be a good opportunity for us to just kind of sit around and shoot the bull. Great. Uh, well, yesterday at the bank. <laughs> Great story, Steve. Listen, you know the kind of room that I think you and Marcy really need? A pool room for you and me. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I think Marcy and I should get a room we both like. But she's got one. She's got the kitchen. <laughs> you need something to fill up your life, and, and, and I think this room is the perfect thing. See, Steve, remember how great it was when you were a kid and you had your own room and you had the privacy to do whatever you wanted to? You can do those things again, Steve. I don't need to do that anymore. I've got a wife now. <laughs> and a terrific little wife she is, too. She would never stand in the way of you wanting your pool room. Listen, think of it, Steve. A little refrigerator for your beer. A little powder on your hands. That feeling of the cue stick sliding through your fingers. It, Squeak of the chalk, but most of all, that feeling of adrenaline coursing through your veins as you make that two-cushion bank shot, eight ball in the side pocket. <sighs> Gee, that was a great workout. You want some pie? <laughs> sure. It really does give you an appetite, doesn't it? Ah, uh, the boys are at your house talking about your new room. So, uh, what kind of room is this gonna be? An all-purpose room. What a waste. Why not build a room with a purpose? Like an exercise room for you and me. Ice cream? Sure. Gee, an exercise room would be great. Then we wouldn't have to wait in line to use their equipment and be laughed at by women with good bodies. <laughs> Chocolate sauce? Okay. I don't know, Peggy. Steve and I wanted a room we could both use. Oh, Steve has his own room. He has the kitchen. <laughs> Besides, aren't you sick of dragging me along each week to be your free guest at the health club? I mean, they know I'm not gonna join. Doesn't that embarrass you? Well... Not as much as you stealing towels. Hey, that sign said, guest towels, take one. <laughs> look, Mars, if you build an exercise room, not only will you look better, but you'll live longer. And isn't that the best possible present you could give Steve? <laughs> Whipped cream? What the heck? I'm gonna have an exercise room, right? Right. 